whenever I show up in a high school and I come across intelligent people, I want to show them to you. You see, I've been in a Hunterman this morning because they were having um, coronation, coronation. And somebody alerted me that there's this girl in this school. Smartest, smart. Sister, what is your name? My name is Elvina Victoria Boaten. Elvina Victoria Boaten. You live in Takradi here. here. You yes. live in Takradi here. Yes, she, she is a Takradinian. Amazing. Tell me the truth. This uniform, who made it? Please, I made it myself. I made it. You made this uniform yourself? Yes, please. The rest of the students, their uniform, who made it for them? The school gave it to them. Initially, I was given one. But something happened for which I couldn't wear it again. So I had to make this one. I, I made it overnight. I used just a day. To do this? Yes, it was Sunday. I had to come to school on Monday. So I had to do it. And then you went to buy the fabric? Yeah, I asked the day student to buy it. And then they bought you did it here in school? Yes. Hostel. Hostel? Yes. What, what program do you do here? Home economics? No, please. I'm offering general art. General art? Yes. So, where did you learn how to do this? My mom enrolled me in a um, training center right after JHS. Yes. So Right after JHS, what happened? I, I started um, going to that school, the training center. So, before I got admission in Ahans, I was already there. So anytime school vacates, I go there and then I learn. When school resumes, I come back. That's how my routine has been. Yes. So you see, this is very interesting because there are a whole lot of high school students just when they are done with BEC, what becomes a routine for them is they buy dresses and then start roaming around beaches. They take photos and put them on Instagram. You know the things you've been seeing on social media and all that. This girl has a different agenda. And of course, big ups to your mom. What's your mom's name? My mom's name is Doris Boatin. Mrs. Doris Boatin. Mrs. Doris Boatin. Yes. I think people should emulate the woman. She's, you know, she said that right after school, the mom enrolled her in a training center, a vocational school, where she made her learn craft. Yeah. Please, if you're a parent and your world finished uh, JHS, don't, don't, see, let them, Give them something to do. Don't let them roam around. Don't let them... Mommy, ask, ask yourself, why am I like this? <laughs> Don't do that. You see, so now, when you are done with school, high school, yeah. will you be able to provide services in exchange for money, like so? Yes. Now, how my routine is, Right after school, I will go back and then complete, write an exam. It's like I'll make a dress as an exam and then wait for my results. Yeah, and then I will go to university afterwards. Ha have you, have you sold something that you've made before? Yeah, ever since I started this training center, I've been making dresses to church every Sunday. So I hardly repeat dresses now. Hey, yes. <laughs> you have a lot. Yes. <laughs> what else can you do aside the sewing crocheting to his part crocheting the one they use pin to do this yeah and i play drums as well you play drums yes church drums i play drums in school yeah and also when it comes to comedy i'm there like because even... because your head girl told me you are very jovial very very funny artistic human being like that. M Mr. Preku, you were yes, a teacher in this school. Yes. What what testimony do you give about this lady? Do you know do you even know her? Yes, I know her. Well, she's in my class. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes, and she's also part of the drama club, the school's drama club. Uh, and I'm the patron of the drama club. Amazing. So I've seen her act. She's a very good actress. And I've seen her do comedy stand-up comedy on stage and I've seen her playing drums, cultural drums for cultural so she dances. she can play the form. conga and the djembe? Yes, she can play the drums, she can act, she can do stand-up comedy. I see her do a lot of things. Currently, she even holds a position in the choir. She can also sing? She can sing very well. So she even holds a position. What's the position? Auto-part leader. Auto-part leader. 
leader. Autopart. Auto, 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 auto leader. leader. Oh, I see. Amazing. So this girl, I see her everywhere. And she has so much in her that she needs a push. Serious push to make it big. Amazing. Yeah. So you see, this. these are some of the things we try to bring it to you when we get into the high school. There are a lot of awful things we can share, but to, to what? They are not necessary. There are people who need a lot of encouragement and motivation. So when we tell the story of this girl over here, and then any other person who is going a way that is not good, they will know that, no, tell us, why don't I change? Why don't I take a U-turn and also, go away, go, go away. <laughs> I don't take don't I take a U-turn. So this is a story that is so inspiring. And please share her story and let her feel so much motivated. Sister, I I I I don't know what to say, but I'm looking forward to seeing you um at a spot where you'll be doing, especially sewing something. And I'll be there to witness it, crocheting or playing a drum. I will come back here again so that you do something for everybody to see. Is that okay? Please. Maybe you should come in the 75th anniversary. 75th anniversary. Yes. I will come here purposely to see you, just because of you, to see how you're going to contribute to the anniversary.